Welcome to Writing Matters. My name is Vanessa, and today we're having a lightning round. Number one, the town website has a handy new link on the top right that says, how do I? This is a place where you can sign up for things like town alerts, text, and phone calls. Um, so you'll be alerted when there are urgent or upcoming happenings around town. Things like street closures or emergencies in the area or elections. Uh, you can also use this section of the website to sign up to receive emails for when meetings or hearings are posted. And there's a long list of um, categories that you can choose from. This is also where you can find the link to see, click, fix. This is a super easy place to report things like street lights that are out or a fallen branch blocking the street or potholes. Um, most of these requests are handled by our fabulous DPW staff, and they have an excellent record of getting to most of the requests within a few days to a week. All right. Number two, public comment. Public comment is the time in a board committee or commission's meeting where the public can speak on anything they wish to express relevant to that board committee or commission. Um, every BCC has their own way of handling public comment, some at the very beginning, some in the middle, some at the end. If you want to speak but aren't sure when that's going to be allowed, I would suggest raising your hand and just asking when public comment um, will be held. If you arrive early, you can always ask in advance. It's important to note that these meetings are governed by open meeting law. That's a state law that governs what can be talked about in a public meeting. This is done so that the public will always know what is going to be on the agenda and deliberated on and can tune in accordingly. What this means for you is that if you raise a subject that is not on the board's agenda for that night, the board cannot legally talk about it. So you'll likely receive something like this from the chair. Thank you for your comment. This isn't a brush off. Uh, they just aren't allowed to express opinions on it because it wasn't on the agenda. If you are asking the board to do something or want them to respond to you, I suggest that you ask what the next steps are to address your concern, because that is something that they may be able to answer or at least provide a little bit more information on. And as a reminder, these boards are all unpaid volunteers who are also your neighbors, so please be kind. All right, number three how to get involved. Um, to get an idea of what board committees and commissions are available, you can check out the town website and click on board. That contains the full list. Um, volunteers serve three-year terms and interviews are generally held in May and June of each year with the terms officially starting in July. However, there are frequently openings at other times of year in the event that someone has stepped down from a role. Um, you can check out um, which boards, committees, and commissions have openings by going to the town website and searching for volunteer opportunities. This is also where you'll find the form you'll need to submit to the town clerk's office if you want to be considered for a position. Let's get involved, Reading. Uh, oh, thanks for watching. Um, follow the YouTube channel, Reading Matters 01867, to get updates when new videos are available.